Hey Capricorn, I hope all is well. I appreciate you for being here. This is going to be a love reading for Capricorn, Suns, Moon, Rising, Venus. Also check your Jupiter in your North Node. Keep in mind it won't resonate with every single Capricorn, all right? So take what resonates, leave the rest. Personal readings in the description box. Um, numerology reports to the end of February in the description box. Um, that's it, you guys. Also, TikTok, Instagram, all that good stuff. Just read the description box, you guys. You'll see everything you want to see. If you're looking for it, that is. Oh, so that's how we starting off, huh? Ooh, Capricorn. All right. Express your love. Codependency. If you can see that. Let me turn that light down. I always got to turn the light down for y'all. All right. Codependency, there we go. Reconciliation. And then we have pay attention to the red flags on the bottom of the deck. So, hmm, Capricorn, are you weary of someone that might wanna come back from the past? You might not fully trust this person. Whoever this is, why is expression love here? For Capricorns. Okay, this flipped. I'm going to show you guys. I want to put it back because it flipped over and then it turned over. The Five of Pentacles flipped over. So someone may feel um, abandoned by you or uh, you turn someone down or you turn someone's offer down. That's the vibe that I'm getting. I just saw the Eight of Cups as I was shuffling. Could be someone you have a family with. The Three of Wands, guys. Yeah. Very kind of, so far it's kind of similar to Virgos. Uh, yeah. The Ten of Cups is why I said it. It could be a family situation. But I, someone you have a family with. I feel like someone might be waiting on you to reach out to them. Or vice versa. You might be waiting to hear from somebody. Why is codependency here, Spirit? got the exact same energy for Virgo so some of you guys I think you are in Virgo's reading too whoa yeah okay Ooh. so we have the seven of pentacles yeah the five of cups and the ten of cups again guys <laughs> okay so um now, someone may have a family already. You may have um, got rid of someone because they had a family already. The tower is on the bottom of the deck. So, Capricorn, I feel like um, someone regrets, have some regrets regarding y'all's connection, and they want to come back around and fix things with you. This person may have been, with this Ten of Cups being here, this person may be emotionally draining. This person might be an energy vampire. Ooh. Cards going all over the place. Hold on, y'all. Okay, so, but what came out, though? Yeah. Ooh, this is the same energy from Virgo's reading. The Nine of Pentacles and the Six of Wands came out. Something fell on the floor, too, so let me... See if I can grab it without messing up the camera. Because if the camera's going to mess up, it's just going to be like, look, this card. <sighs> okay, so I feel like, you guys, you're, you're putting in a whole lot of work. Uh, you, it's something you put a whole lot of work in. And um, the worth wasn't work, worth it. The, the juice wasn't worth the squeeze. I say that. There we go. Got it. Whoa. Same exact cards for Virgos. These fell out on the floor. I'm not going to take these, but these are the exact same cards that came out for Virgo. Okay. So, um, yeah, I feel like something was really, um, something was really burdensome for, for you behind the scenes. But this person tried to make it look like, you know, they're, y'all's relationship was great 
this person may have a different view of the relationship than you do Capricorn you might look at it as a burden whereas they look at it as you know it was great it was lovely it was grand however you may have been putting in more financially than them or even something more emotionally than them and so of course they're going to feel like everything was cool everything you know everything was sweet because they weren't putting in as much as you yeah <laughs> Capricorn you you're not going to want this person back child so we have the eight of swords we got the four of cups and we have the six of swords you really just want to move past this and heal from it that's the vibe that I'm getting this person could this could be someone you have a family with or you may have found out they had a family they may still have a family or they still because the, the ten of cups can be um, the dark side of the ten of cups can be because it's coming up under the pay attention to the red flags so the dark side of the, the ten of cups can be someone that's like seriously emotionally draining and I feel like you just you don't have any interest in that anymore. You don't have any interest in putting uh, putting in, in this much energy anymore with this uh, seven of pentacles. I feel like you put in a lot of work, and this person became codependent on that. They depend heavily on you putting in all the work, while they pretty much you know floss around and, and make it look like oh well, me and Capricorn's relationship is perfect. You know, me and Capricorn they might post pictures of you guys on social media and. You know, y'all lovey-dovey and stuff on social media. That's also the Ten of Cups. Lovey-dovey and stuff on social media, but you really like this in, in the background. You know what I mean? Just not interested, kind of disconnected from the relationship. Yeah. I feel like this person likes to... They like to show the world a certain side of them while they hide... Uh, certain aspects you saw the other aspects of this person you saw this person in, a, in another light and you don't i feel like you don't want anything to do with him <laughs> they do regret though how things played out capricorn so i will say that they do regret how things played out with this five of cups here but i'm, I'm getting a a vibe of they may not be a hundred percent um accountable for their role in what happened if that makes sense Okay, they might be. Um, let me pull one more card. They might be a little bit um, delusional in a sense of their role. This is not someone that's going to take uh, accountability for anything. The Queen of Pentacles, yeah, this person may have had a family, or again, you could have been with this person, you could be, have had a family with this person. This is also Capricorn energy here. Yeah, they, they see you as emotional fulfillment. They do want to give you a, a love offer. They want to have a solid offer with you. However, I feel like you don't really see... You don't really see it, it growing. I feel like you really just want to move on. Oh, 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 shit, Capricorn. So, ooh, so we got the moon wow we got death guys we got the eight of swords again capricorn oh and we got the ten of swords yeah you not you don't fuck with this person <laughs> what they did is gonna be different for all of you you guys but i feel like i'm i'm getting the vibe of they took you for granted i'm getting the vibe this person may have uh, lie to you about a family situation I'm getting the vibe of this person just really wasn't pulling their weight and again for a lot of you they may have been dependent on you financially you ready to be done like you're ready to just completely away with this energy but they're not done <laughs> they want to try to come back around but they know Capricorn that you're not with the shit they know they know and I feel like a lot of them, they are waiting on you to return. I feel like you are going to hear from them, though, Capricorn. But you don't, I feel like you just don't want anything to do with them at all. You may even be ignoring them. 
child. I mean, you got the moon here, death, the eight of swords, and the ten of swords. I mean, this is Capricorn. You're done, done with this person. The four of cups, the six of swords, child. It's, it don't get any more done than this. <laughs> it doesn't get any more done than this. Child. All right. So we got Pray For Me by Anthony Hamilton. Yeah, they, they, this person definitely is going to need prayer, especially if they think they're going to approach you again. Capricorn, this might be a twin flame for you. Doesn't mean you have to be with them, though, okay? Exchange by Bryson Tiller. We starting off with all these songs. I'm coming back to you, baby. I told you they'll be back. Regardless of how they feel, because they know that they fucked up and they know that you're not going to want to deal with them again. Communication through music, yeah. You guys may have communicated through music with each other or you hear certain songs. Yeah, you're getting a lot of songs. 3 a.m. by Janine. I want to see you right now. I miss your touch. Aww. So beautiful by Music Soul Child. Lots of music. You deserve much better than me. I believe uh, Virgo got this too. Some of you guys are definitely dealing with a Virgo. Rent free by six lakh, guys. <laughs> All right, Capricorn, that's y'all's reading. I hope it resonated with you. If it did, hit that like, hit that subscribe, you guys. I appreciate you so much for watching. And until next time, y'all, peace out.